today we're going to look at the division strategy of counting by. Remember, in multiplication, we count by a number because multiplication is all about groups of an equal size. Division is the same, just backwards. Instead of knowing how many groups and how many are in each group, we are trying we know how many we have all together and we know how many are in each group. So when we look at division, we can count by a number up until the total. Let me explain. Sometimes a division problem will be written like this. We can read this by saying 35 divided by 5 and our answer goes above. Or we can think of 35 divided by 5 in this way. When we are trying to count by, we have this as our total and we're sharing in groups of 5. We need to know how many times can we share 5 so that we get 35 altogether. So we're going to count by 5's. 5, 10, 15. Remember, we're going to count by 5's until we reach our total, which is 35. 20, 25, 30, 35. Now we need to know how many times we counted by 5's because that will be our answer. We counted by 5's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 times. So 35 divided by 5 is 7. Or if we see it written this way, 35 divided by 5 is 7.